We've all heard about it. Plastic polluting our earth and ruining its natural beauty. But did you know the only plastic isn't just the plastic you see and feel every day. Plastic is actually everywhere in tiny pieces called microplastics. According to the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or the NOAA, microplastics are pieces of plastic less than 5 millimeters long that are polluting our oceans and animals are inhaling it. Microplastics have been found in fish as well as many different animals. It's even possible for humans to breathe in microplastic. It's actually everywhere in many daily supplies, such as fleece jackets, plastic toys, plastic bags, and plastic fibers. In fact, microplastic can even be contaminated in your water. It is everywhere, and it is a big problem. So what are the solutions? Well, unfortunately, there aren't many solutions. However, we are not completely out of luck. One of many solutions including reducing the use of plastic. Microplastics break loose from other plastics. Another solution would be to reuse and recycle. Microplastic normally comes from plastic that has deteriorated. So if we reuse and recycle, it will be less likely that plastic will end up in the ocean and microplastic will break apart from it. Also, that brings you to another topic that we'll discuss a different day. Normal plastic pollution in the ocean. But anyways, let's stay on topic. Maybe we should stop using our Lululemons because they contain, guess what, microplastics. Yeah. And there aren't actual statistics. Because microplastic is way too new. Or why don't we just give up on plastic all alone? Plastic is a very big part of world pollution. So why don't we just change to compostable items? Such as compostable forks or compostable straws. And... Maybe we can just use reusable ones. Maybe we can just make plastic a thing of the past. And all of that comes from you. So you should take action today to prevent our Earth from turning bad. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like the video.